Hello and welcome to Yesterday's Airlines. Just recently I posted a video talking about Dragon Wings models from um, the early 2000s and how they really shouldn't be ignored and I've recently just expanded uh, my Dragon collection with a few of their Space Line. Now Dragon is the only 400 scale manufacturer that's ever attempted to produce space related models and to be honest they are really really good and actually hard to find too. Uh, Dragon has produced quite a wide range. They've produced a series of rockets um, and they've produced a series of shuttles. And recently, thanks to a friend in Australia, I was able to acquire three of the different shuttle models. And I thought I'd just quickly um, produce a very short video just to show you around and show you what quality these are because they're all really lovely releases. So we we'll start with this one, which is um, the Space Shuttle Endeavour um, attached to the fuel tank and the solid rocket boosters that enable the shuttle to launch, as you can see in the, uh, the picture on the book in the background. And you can see that the model quite nicely comes with this um, stand and it enables it to be shown in an upright position as if it is launching off of the gantry. Um, the shuttle itself is, is really nicely made and the model has a really good level of detail. It's a really attractive um, shuttle and the SRBs um, and the fuel tank also look really good. The next model I've got is, uh, is even quirkier and that is another space shuttle. In this case, it is an Endeavour, it is Atlantis, and she is also attached to um, the fuel tank and the solid rocket boosters, but she's also on the tracked vehicle, which was used to transport the shuttle very slowly um, from the hangar to the launch pad. And this is a really nicely uh, and really finely put together model from Dragon. The little uh, launch vehicle here is, is really nice and the whole thing comes apart um, beautifully as well so you can have it displayed in different components. For example, I can take off the shuttle itself and the rocket boosters and they can be displayed independently. Um, and also you can take off this portion and just see the actual tracked vehicle and you can see that it's really nicely done. It looks kind of like something out of Aliens actually, but uh, it looks really good. So these are really nice models. Obviously um, the track vehicle here is plastic, but the shuttle is very much die cast as are the solid rocket boosters on the fuel tank there. And the last um, one that I managed to pick up is another shuttle. This one is the space shuttle um, which space shuttle is it? Columbia, that's <laughs> it, the first one, Columbia. And here she is shown in orbit with the cargo doors open and a mission payload um, visible. And again, there's a really nice detail here. And this is one of the areas where having plastic for some of the components really enables you to have some fine detail. And Dragon have done an excellent job on this whole space series. I'm super impressed by these space models. Um, I don't really have enough room for them, it's a bit naughty collecting them, um, but I couldn't resist the opportunity to pick up a couple of them. So, you know, I can highly recommend Dragon's Space Series. Uh, I don't think they're making them anymore, um, but they produce quite a, a wide range of shuttles and rockets, and they are all really nice. Thanks very much for watching. Um, you know, as always, check out the website, Yesterday's Airlines, for more of this kind of material. Talk about 400 scale models, um, but mainly uh, airliners, not spaceships. And uh, also, obviously, subscribe if you like the video. Check me out on Instagram. And um, yeah, thanks very much. See you later.